RANTED! So, you all saw the Nintendo Direct Mini, right? On the 11th of the 1st, 2018? Disappointing again. Uh, something I just don't agree with. I mean, there's just nothing here that appeals to me. There's Pokemon, Pokemon Tournament, a few characters added, which, again, doesn't... Just, just doesn't appeal to me. You got this game that's been out for ten years coming back. You got Kirby game, which I may play. Looks quite interesting. I've never played a Kirby game before. Actually, I tell you, I played one the other day on my uh, NES Classic. You know, the very like well, I don't know if it's the very first Kirby, but I played that Kirby on there, and it was a, uh, it's quite fun. So I can't wait to stream that one day. You know, it's just a lot of disappointing stuff. Again, I was waiting for Smash Brothers, but again, you know, nothing on Smash Brothers. Lots of more ports as well. We got Dragon Dragon Quest Builders. Um, we got like another uh, port, Hyrule Warriors, the Definitive Edition, where you can be like Breath of the Wild Link and Breath of the Wild Zelda, and you get all the DLC, which very unfor unfortunate. Uh, if I knew it was going to come out on the Switch, I probably wouldn't have got all the DLC because I only got like the DLC like towards the end of the year. Still need to complete that actually. Um, and you can play local carp with it, which is quite quite cool, I must admit, but still, I won't get it again. We've got a Mario Tennis game, not much interested in that at all. Where's my Smash Brothers? <laughs> Where is my Smash Brothers? Where's something to pull me in, you know? I just All the games just don't interest me on this. I think, I don't, I don't even know, really. I think even like Mario and Rabbids Kingdom Battle, that didn't... That kind of appeals to me. I would like to play it, see what it's like. Um, Super Mario Odyssey got a update balloon hiding thing. I don't know what that's about. Not interested. Payday 2, still not interested. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just not really interested in any of it, to be honest. There's a Tropical Freeze, I think. Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze. Um, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Um, may get it, not sure I didn't get the Wii version, but may get it, not quite sure, but I'm not going to pay like 60 quid for, you know, um, a game that's been out on the Wii, definitely not. Um, then we got Dark Souls, I've got Dark Souls, I've never played Dark Souls, but I need to play it, I need to play it eventually, I don't know when to play it, I've got so many games to get for it, it's ridiculous. But yeah, Dark Souls on the Switch, I said anything like handheld. And that you can take on the go is good. I mean, like, especially like Grand Theft Auto, lo like local play. Imagine that if they did like Grand Theft Auto um, 5 local play. So you literally just someone else gets a switch and then you just switch v switch. That'd be cool. That, like the whole city, just the two of you, or four if you get more, or just just how many you get. I don't know, but still got the PC version, so I'm alright with that. Um, got Dark Souls already. Just pretty much, I was expecting something again, something better. You know, something, something either new or like something else. I mean, like, okay, maybe as such, it was probably overhyped again. But I didn't think anyway they was gonna do super, super, another Super Smash Brothers unless it is a Super Smash Brothers with all DLC. And I heard somewhere, I'm not quite sure if this is confirmed, but if if they are making another Super Smash Brothers, if they are, I mean, I, I swear they said the last Super Smash Brothers was the last one. I swear they did, but then, like, a video came out saying that uh, when a con new console's released, they're going to make a new Super Smash Brothers, a new Mario game, a new Zelda game, and all that. That's like the uh, Mario Kart and other things as well. But I swear somewhere they said it was going to not make any more Super Smash Brothers. But if they're going to have, or they're going to have. In the Super Smash Bros. we got all the DLC with two new characters, and I even heard that somewhere two new characters are going to be in it as well. So I'm I'm unsure. It's all up in the air of like what the hell is going to be going on and and stuff. But yeah, I, I'm just I just not interested in anything they they're putting out there. To be honest, we'll not get anything what this, what's coming out at Switch on that direct Super Smash Bros. Yes, definitely. But again, hasn't shown. Um, I mean, what are your guys' favourites? Is there something you're going to get? Or what are you guys waiting for? Do you think this Direct was shameful, just like the last one? I mean, I can't, I can't believe we got, like, Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon and, and, and Pokken Tournament for the last Direct. And now this Direct, we've got two or three characters added on to the new, new po po Pokemon Tournament. When's my new Pokemon game coming out? When's my new Super Smash Bros. coming out? When is it coming out? I can't wait much longer. It's just like... 
the past two times now. Now, I, don't get me wrong, I don't watch a lot of Nintendo Directs. I try and do it. If someone tells me, oh, Nintendo Direct or something, I'll, I'll try and catch it. I'll try and do a live stream. But um, I haven't been keeping up since the last one before this one. I just, I've been like, ugh. But then no one's told me anyway, so I can't really <laughs> say too much. But what do you guys reckon? Do you think they're failing a little bit with like this stuff they're bringing out? Are they running out of ideas? I don't know. I mean, was you guys looking forward to a Super Smash Brothers? Was you guys looking forward to... I was hoping maybe Mario Maker, because then I can get rid of my Wii U. But, <laughs> I don't know. So yeah, that was mainly what I was waiting for, was Super Smash Brothers and a Pokemon game. See, what I would think they could do with the Pokemon game, is they could bring back, like, they go right to the beginning. Like, a, a 3D or first person view of the fir very first Pokemon games on the Switch, but obviously upgraded and stuff. Uh, something like that would be quite cool. Or even Pokemon Stadium or something. I know they've got Pokemon. Uh, that's probably what they're going to do though, aren't they? They're just going to use Poke Pokemon tournament instead of po uh, you know, Pokemon tournament. And po Pokemon Coliseum. They're going to use po Pokemon, aren't they? Ah, oh, that's just unfair. I don't like it. No. <laughs> what I think they should do as well. Um, here's an idea I've got. With the Joy-Con, you could have... You could assign six Pokemon with the new Pokemon game to one controller. Now that would be quite cool. And like, if you want to battle a friend on their console, you bring your Joy-Con with your Pokemon on. And like six Pokemon. Oh, you can only hold up to six. And can connect it somehow to the console. And you can have that six, battle with that six Pokemon. Or, or you can have even better, take two Joy-Cons with you. And each Joy-Con can hold up to like six Pokemon each. And that's 12. So if you just one team want to swap out for another team, you can. And that'd be quite cool. And also connect to your friend's Switch to swap Pokemon around from the two Joy-Cons. Or, or yeah, that'd be good. Or something like that. I don't know. Or trade using the Joy-Cons. Think about that. That'd be absolutely amazing to do. What a great idea that would be. Um, I'm just full of great ideas. But um, something like that would be amazing. I don't know how they'd do it. I, I guess it wouldn't be... I guess it would just be one controller, the one with the NFC. Because I guess you can like, transfer Pokemon through NFC. And if only one of the controllers got NFC with the Amiibos, I've got it. So I guess you could do it that way. Not sure. But that's a great idea as well. But yeah, it's a shame they didn't reveal like Mario Maker. Because I would definitely get Mario Maker for the Switch and then get rid of my, Switch, uh, my Wii U. Same with um, High Warriors. I was actually thinking, I was like, oh, I wish I had High Warriors on the Switch, and then I can get rid of High Warriors. And I've got that, but I don't think I'll buy it, because I've already built all the, bought all the DLC. This is before I bought the DLC as well, so I was, like, oh, I was hoping they'd bring it out for the Switch like, straight away. And if that was the case, I would have done it, but no, it's not the case. But again, it's just, uh, I just hoping with the next Direct, they mention a Pokemon game for the Switch, or a, you know, um... Pokemon game or a Super Smash Brothers game, and I'm hoping like we get like a few, two new characters Smash. But I'm pretty sure I heard someone say they wasn't doing anyone more after this because Super Smash Brothers games take a, a lot of hard work. So I didn't think they was going to do it. The only they, I think it's going to be this. I think it's going to be a new character and a returning character. That's what I think of my two guesses. It's going to be a brand new character. I think it's either going to be some from Arms. Or the Inklings. One of them. But I don't think it'll be the Inklings because we've already got DLC. If it's going to be Super Smash Bros. with all the DLC, I think it'll be some from ARMS. Unless you get an ARMS outfit. Um, and the returning character would probably be Ice Climbers. That's my opinion. That's what I think. And it'll be just a complete uh, Super Smash Bros. port. But as I said before, guys, what do you think? What would you have wanted to see? Um, did you like the Direct? It was a mini Direct. I don't know what the difference is. Did you like it? So let me know. Did you think I'm wrong? What games do you want to see out? Are you going to get any of these games? Just let me know in the comments. Also, guys, I don't know yet, but let me guys know what you think of this. I may put Ranted on my other channel now, so just to give my other channel a bit more content. So if you're looking for Ranted on this channel, it may transfer to the other one. But again, just comment in, uh, in the comments and just let me know if you want that or do you want it still on the main channel. If I don't get much response, I'll probably just chuck it on there anyway. But if you don't, just let me know if you want it on here.